and All are right. we back? We are Sorry. live. Welcome back, everybody, to quarterfinal number three. We have six seed Major Zero and a three seed JMC. G, two, three, two. So, any initial thoughts? Um, yeah, JMC was pretty excited to be a part of this race, right? Like, I'd say he's been like kind of raring to go. Major Zero, um, you know, just wanted to take part due to the the nature of what we're doing here. Um, I think JMC is obviously the favorite, but I think they're relatively close in skill level and could go either way. Obviously, any mistake can happen at any time. It's the tanker. Yeah. And also, if Olga decides to be in favor of one, it can also save a bit of time. All right, I just gave them a countdown, and they should be going here in a moment. So, good luck to the both of them. This should be a very interesting race, to say the least. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, you know, Major is not the biggest MGS2 runner. Um, I'll say that about him. JMC has been into a lot more MGS, especially the tanker, although he's more of a dog tags runner. Um, he does like doing the, the IL of the tanker as well. Um, <laughs> we can see one player is clearly using uh, the trainer version. Uh, is right, currently playing as Ocelot. <laughs> so, BMN's uh, trainer that he made, uh, which Platonic will do a run of in the game later, allows you to uh, hack the game in certain ways, and we did allow it for the race. Um, it won't make a difference to their actual ability to do this run any faster, uh, but it is funny to look at. So, uh, yeah, just a little surprise for you. For you there. Memes, I, I love it. Yeah, I'm, I'm really into this. <laughs> oh my god, this is, I'm not going to be able to concentrate this, on this, this race so at funny. all. This is so good. Yeah, it really is. So, uh, BMN's trainer allows you to change your name, allows you to do all kinds of little things like kill yourself, change story flags. We won't see Major changing any story flags, hopefully. Um, I, mean, I want to say JMC is slightly ahead, but it's really difficult to tell, obviously, the loads uh, can be different from PC to PC, but they're not counted for the IGT, so we'll get an accurate score uh, right at the end of the race. Yeah, they, they started pretty much at the same time, even with the, the sync delay and whatnot, so um, it, they're pretty even. I mean, Olga will be the first telltale of who's ahead or whatever. I've been with the unit since I was born. I grew up on the battlefield, conflict, and victory So we're getting a, a left side for, for Major. Did uh, JMC get the shot at the back? Left side shot at the back. I think that's what it looked like. I didn't see, and JMC struggling a little bit just to get out of Olga. He does, uh, he has commented before that he does have a little bit of trouble with Olga uh, at times. Uh, and there will be something to be said about nerves. I think JMC can be quite a nervous player at times. For sure, for sure. But, but he's, yeah, got a, he's got a lot of talent. So, I, I mean, yeah. anything can happen. So Mage has got it under control there to begin with on Olga. And he goes for the Dav Drop as well, but doesn't get it. That's really cool to see from Major because he is a relatively new MGS play, MGS2 player. Uh, he more, more specializes in MGS3. And we'll see him running some MGS3 on this channel just a little bit later. And tomorrow as well. So Ocelot is faster than Snake, confirmed. Yeah. <laughs> Just don't, you know, don't question it, it's fine. Don't question it. Oh my. This is really making a difference now. Major's pulling ahead quite nicely. Yeah. But um, I would say the more technical parts of the run, and certainly what we've seen quite a few players struggle with so far is is uh, the holds. And obviously the guard rush. There's so much variance in a guard rush uh, from a good one to a bad one, so... Plenty of time to catch up yet. He's not out. He's certainly not out of this race yet. May just gone for the swag engine room. I don't even do this, and I've been running this game for like two years. But that looks nice. And GMC going for that as well. So if you drop down and shoot the guard's radio, it will bring in the backup unit, which on very easy, it only takes one roll to knock them all out. Um, so because of that, um, 
so because of that, uh, it will allow you to skip this cutscene here when you begin the sensor room. So it saves like, you know, half a second. And we have got a donation from Mayu for $75. It's going to read this out. I also have to get something in. And can't think of a better time to do so than the tournament. I loved the few runs so far and look forward to all the other runs. And that's a really nice donation. Thank you. <laughs> that is unreal. 75 bucks. Holy hell. Thank you so, so much. We, we set a target. Problem. We set a target for the weekend of, uh, of $200. And like, in my heart, I knew, I know this community. You're, you're all fucking wonderful. Like, honestly, excuse me, my French there. Hey, you're all hey, wonderful hey. people. <laughs> in this tournament, you're allowed to say that, so... <laughs> you know, I, I knew we'd smash it. Every, it's got, it's all gone so well. Um, you know, every target we've set has been smashed. And just thank you so much to, to everyone. And thank you, Mike, for that donation. That was really nice. No problem. So, Major Zero is still slightly ahead, but this is sort of the portion of the game where it's kind of difficult to pull ahead. Um, the guard rush now, obviously, is where you can make up a lot of time. Yeah. Um, May just picks up that guard behind the box quite nicely, but he hasn't reloaded well and he also had the unfortunate part where the, the guard's invincible and he has to wait for him to pop out. So he's waiting on like a double roll here. So if JMC picks up these guards a bit quicker, uh, he could pull ahead here. Uh oh. That's unfortunate, but he has still made up so much time on Major Zero there. Made up so much time on Major Zero there, it really has. Yeah. Yeah, this is anybody's game at this point. One mistake, it's gonna be one mistake. Major's crazy, the way he plays is crazy. He's going for one punch buffer camera and playing the game like a uh, week. Uh, oh my god. That was hard to look at. That was, that's so hard to look at. <laughs> Just one mistake in it now. I can barely really is who blinks first. Oh, that no, may, may just absolutely tackled this. He really has. I, I can't see him making a mistake with the cameras now. I think this will be it. Yeah, so Major unfortunate with upset. that. With that slight hold up, it's like, you know, it can happen. It's a risk, right? It can happen. It's rare. Major's gone for two spot. Major plays this game like he's been, he's been playing it for years. He really does. Yeah. But it's always a risk with two spot. It's very easy to miss a photo. And JMC as well, with two spot. All right, here we go. Oh, what the fuck? This is no! it. No! Major! No! <laughs> Missed a photo. I can't oh, believe you choked on that. Oh my goodness. How are JMC's photos? They're Perfect. good. Perfect. They're good. 617. I can't believe it. Oh, my Major had it in the bag and that happens i can't believe it people oh what is what, what the hell is You're going on here <laughs> oh hold three of all things like the photos of all things like oh my goodness 637 20 seconds major zero the upset <laughs> for the semi-final wow very exciting to watch. JMC was uh, Major Zero so close to upsetting him with the Ocelot skin there. So close to going through as the unseeded hero in a way, but well, <laughs> I, did, if, I if called you... it, man. Two spot. <laughs> it's so easy to mess up. If you like that, stay tuned for our last quarterfinal matchup. Makarov 360, who just did that wonderful Splinter Cell run, and Gogo BMN, who's a hell of a runner. Be right back. Can't wait.